Hey altcoin fans, thanks for joining me here on Altcoin Radar. Today guys, we're going to learn all about Annex Finex annex finance from a complete beginner's perspective and as always guys hey if you like my content then go ahead and make sure to subscribe to the channel and go ahead and give the video a thumbs up as well and as always guys hey feel free to follow me on twitter as well you can find the link in the description below i'm pretty active on twitter it's a fun place to hang out and meet new people and you know just talk about alt altcoins on a daily basis so if you're into that sort of thing hey go ahead and give me a follow uh, but otherwise today guys we're going to talk all about annex finance where uh we're going to take a look at it from a complete beginner's perspective. Um, you know, for those of you who are new to my channel, I do videos like this for a specific reason. I like to get beginners into crypto. I like to, um, you know, it, it's a great way, you know, here's the thing. Beginners aren't experts, okay? You cannot talk to a beginner like they're already an expert. You have to talk to them like they're a beginner. So that is what we are going to do. We're literally going to go through the website. We're going to go through it, you know, page by page. And we're going to check out the white paper and some other things as well. So... Um, if you want to learn about NX Finance, hey, you're going to love this. All right, guys, so NX Finance is clearly it's built on Binance Smart Chain. Um, it's currently trading for $0.28 cents at the time of filming right now, and it's down about 5.6%, but that's really no big deal. Um, and so, yeah, let's go check it out. All right, guys, NX. Uh, money markets, total value locked, 173451000 six hundred and fifteen dollars and you know 22 cents can't forget about that all right guys so it's a decentralized marketplace for lenders and borrowers with borderless stable coins okay that's pretty interesting um clearly it's a uh, certic audited um so let's check that out real quick that's always a big deal here so it's got a security score of 88 that's pretty good that's actually very good um you know there's a lot of projects out there that i've seen that are um, a lot lower than that, so uh, that's uh, the, they're they're pretty good. I you know I'd trust them based on that. Definitely no problem at all. Um, all right, so let's see what we got going on here. So they got you know their app, and then you can buy their token ANN. Uh, let's see here what we got up here. The white paper. Uh, all right, we will open that. A link to that. We'll check that out in a little bit. All right, so a decentralized trading protocol. Um, access to immutable money market protocol directly on chain. Uh, BEP20, all Annex protocol assets are bound by the BEP20 standard. Okay. Um, and then scalable, uh, it's built on Binance Smart Chain for fast, secure, and low cost transactions. And about their coin, it's guaranteed liquidity for millions of users and hundreds of applications. And it's on a profitable blockchain. Um, funds held within the protocol can earn ANN. Earn ANN based on the market demand for that asset. Interest is earned by the block and can be used as collateral to borrow assets or to mint stable coins. All right, that's pretty interesting. And then savings. Um, earn interest on your assets. Funds held within the protocol can earn APYs based on um, annual percentage yields based on uh, the market demand for that asset. Interest is earned by the block and can be used as collateral to borrow assets or mint stable coins. All right, so you got USD coin at 3.58%. Uh, most one here being Tron, obviously, that's 9.05%. Uh, let's see here, and they've got more too, apparently. I don't know where that's going to take us, but oh, it's just that's a kind of a button that leads to nowhere. All right, and then we got auctions, decentralized auction, open source smart contracts auction process for launching a new project, profitable state, profitable blockchain, Annex auction aims to drive new capital and trade to trade to the exchange by increasing the attractiveness of Annex swap as a place for token creators and communities to launch new project tokens. So that's pretty cool, guys. They've got their um, their swapping neck mechanism right in their app app, I would assume. Um, check that out in a little bit and nft marketplace discover collect and sell extraordinary um, nfts with a n n let's see here annex nft marketplace offers a wide range of non-fungible tokens including art censorship resistant domain names virtual virtual worlds um trading cards sports and collectibles that's pretty interesting we will check that out as well um, I will pretty soon, I, I assume that that's going to go to the, yeah, that's going to go to the dashboard. Okay, so we'll check that out in a little bit again. Uh, protocol. Um, you can now tokenize your assets utilizing the Binance Smart Chain and receive profitable A tokens, or ANN, 
um, that you can freely move around to cold storage, transfer to other users, and more. Access is instant liquidity on Annex. Um, borrow on demand. Use your A token collateral to borrow from the Annex protocol instantly with no trading fees, no slippage, and directly on chain. With Annex, you have on demand liquidity available globally. It's uh, quite a bit of liquidity for uh, you know a project like this. All right, and that's superpowers for DeFi developers. Check out check out the documentation. The quick start quick start or a guide below um, to integrate your project with thousands of tokens and billions in liquidity. So we got the A token. Uh, simplify the process of integrating Annex into your project. Uh, programmable liquidity, a step-by-step -step guide to getting started. Building interfaces with Annex Swap. Um, flash swaps, withdraw the reserves of any BEP20 token on Annex and execute uh, arbitrary logic. And oracles, highly decentralized, manipulation resistant, on chain price feeds. All right, and then you got your markets. Okay, so that's pretty much the end of the website there, you guys. So, um, you know, hey, you know, the reason why I do these these uh, these types of videos is specifically for beginners. Okay, I mean that's why the website says specifically for absolute beginners in the title of the video. So, the reason why I do this is because you know the, it, beginners need to understand this kind of stuff, and it's kind of hard to understand when uh, you know different websites of these different projects they don't really do a very good job of explaining it to people who are beginners or who or who who want to get into the scene. Um, most beginners aren't going to understand the things that most companies or most projects are trying to execute on their website. And I'm kind of feeling that with this website as well, but it's, it, I, I, it's definitely, they're trying to get, you know, they're trying to get beginners to use their product. And I, I can definitely tell that just by reading their website, but for a beginner to understand how, how to use it and the way that they need to use it to actually, you know, to their benefit I, I think they're having an issue with, you know, trying to come across with that on the website. But we're going to go ahead and check out the dashboard real quick. You know, I'm trying to be as honest as possible here, guys. Um, you know, I'm neither, um, I don't really form a, I don't try to form a, you know, a 100% a, a opinion based, you know, as if, you know, I really like this project or I really don't like this project. I just try to be as honest as possible here. Um, but we'll check out the dashboard real quick and see what we got going on here. So lending, all right, so we got their lending here. Um, obviously I'm not going to be connecting any of my wallets. I never do in any of my videos because that's kind of personal. All right, and then vote. So you got your voting. Um, annex, uh, I wanna see the NFT marketplace. Where is this? Where is this NFT marketplace that I read on the homepage? So overall, um, let's see here. Okay, so this is their swap. This is their swap. Uh, their swapping mechanism here. Um, so that's cool. Uh, you don't really see this too often. You really don't see too many um, DeFi projects with their own um, swapping DEX, right? Like built into it. So this is pretty cool. All right, and then they got games. Let's see here. Yep. Okay, so they got games. They're just you know probably you know you're, you're they're your typical type of. Um, you know your typical type of like uh, uh, betting type games and stuff like that, um, and then auction. Let's see here. Nothing found for auctions yet. All right. So overall, there's really not much to see here yet in here, and there probably is once you connect your wallet. But again, guys, I don't connect my wallet to this stuff on any of my videos because it's just kind of a personal thing. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and check out the white paper real quick before we wrap this up. All right, guys. So. Uh, the technical white paper, I re read a little bit about this last night as well, So, um, but basically guys, um, the white paper explains the decisions behind NX Finance, it covers the contract features and protocols which brings a complete decentralized finance based lending system to the Binance Smart Chain. NX Finance allows users to utilize their cryptocurrencies by supplying a token or ANN to the network uh, to earn passive income supplying both collateral and liquidity respectively. By utilizing ANN tokens, this enables the community to create a secure lending platform where lenders receive a compound interest rate uh, paid per block while borrower pays interest on the cryptocurrency borrowed, um, supplying liquidity, contributing to the continuation and sustainability of the ecosystem, 
and governance of select protocol features, supporting flexibility and community ownership, and enable purchase and bid of NFT collectibles and auction currency with ANN. Unlike traditional finance systems, Annex Finance is enabled by a integrated DEX so that the community can swap tokens through a community-centric DeFi platform. The community enhances the platform by detaining its govern governance through votes. All right, so the problem here. Uh, the blockchain or the blockchain and decentralized finance uh, finance has created massive diversity in the crypto financial space. This can be extremely daunting for new users. Um, so again, this is a saying right here. They're basically trying to um, they're trying to aim their project here to new users and to be to to beginners. Um, for the model to be massively adopted, the the adopted the DeFi space needs to be new user friendly and secure across the network. And traditional finance financial lending systems. Um, a borrower a borrower needs to provide credit or traceable income to a lender before consideration on lending funds. Um, Annex Finance aims to solve this friction in the traditional lending system by utilizing digital assets and cryptocurrencies to be pledged and used as collateral while earning interest. All right, so here's the thing. Now I, I'm all for I, I'm I'm all for, you know, projects that are aiming their product to be for beginners and stuff like that. But I I don't think, you know, in my, in my, in all honesty, you know, I, I don't see it like nothing on here screams, nothing on their website, um, nothing on here really helps a beginner to understand how their project works and what it is. Um, the way I've talked to a lot of beginners in the space, you guys, and Beginners need to be talked to like they're literally three years old. That's literally how they learn on how you how you learn how you know these different products work. And they're not going to understand any of this that's on this website. That's just not how it is. So if you're going to market to a beginner, you need to do it in a different way rather than, you know, trying to do it in a technological aspect. Um, and I feel like, you know, projects like this, they, you know, they're, I can understand what they're trying to do, but it's, it's the method that they're taking at going at it. Um, you know, they, they need to go at it at a, at a completely different angle here. Uh, whether you agree with me or not, Hey, that's, that's up to you, but you know, Hey, I talk to beginners on a daily, daily basis. I mean, my channel is for nothing but for nothing but, but beginners. So I talk to them all the time. Um, and that's, you know, that a lot of the feedback I get from a lot of people is they have a hard time understanding what the project actually is because on the website, uh, the website basically, do, you know, the website is basically talking to beginners as if they're already experts. And that's like a big no, no in this, you know, in the, if you're trying to market toward to a beginner. Um, all right, but we'll check out the solution and model real quick. Uh, DeFi is essentially a borderless a uh, financial system tackling inefficiencies in the global financial system in order to in order to secure the network annex finance has adapted the DeFi model um, supporting liquidity provided by users wherein the more users the more liquidity providers the more stable and secure the native token will be all right when a native when a user adds liquidity to a pool they become a liquidity provider uh, the token can be then be utilized for either lending, borrowing uh, within the blockchain or compounding itself to earn higher interests. See, like this kind of stuff should be this kind of stuff should be on the main front facing website. I mean, you don't see any of this stuff. This is the stuff that a beginner understands, not any of this stuff. So, you know, I, I'm just I'm just going at it from, you know, I'm just being completely honest here, you guys. Um, due to the nature of this borderless system, this is an enhancement of financial finance, glo finance globally, um, allowing anyone to borrow funding, unlike the traditional system, where currently many countries and peoples are prevented from participation. Additionally, NX finance users would not have to worry about centralized institutions manipulating the user funds. All right. So. We'll check out some key features real quick, and then we'll go ahead and we will, um, you know, go ahead and wrap this up. But be before I, you know, before I start getting any go any further, you guys here, though, I guess the one biggest thing that I could see that would really benefit people on this, you know, on Annex Finance's website is the one thing they're missing here is a, an FAQ section. You know, just a simple, you know, frequently asked questions section. Um, those little sections they really help people out more than more than you might think. Um, I mean, they really do. So some of the key features of Annex Finance. Um, it's a BEP20 token swap and liquidity mining. 
Uh, you can borrow cryptocurrencies and stablecoins with collateralized lending through the Binance Smart Chain Network and supply cryptocurrencies and stablecoins and earn variable APY for providing liquidity to the protocol and borrow stablecoins from supplied collateral. And initial liquidity provider will get extremely high APY with ANN. See bonus structure below. All right, so that's pretty much it. Um, but there's, you know, there's a lot of other things as well that's uh, pretty great with, uh, you know, there's a lot of things that, um, what, that I got from my own personal research into this project you guys and i'll tell you a little bit about it real quick um so you know within you know since the first of september which as you guys can tell right now it's the end of september but since the first of september you guys they've done quite a bit i mean they've i mean they've had their um complete project you know it's uh certic audited uh completed with skynet um that happened within the last month um they were uh, recently listed on CoinMarketCap. They were recently listed on CoinGecko. Um, they were recently listed on DBank. Um, and they added TR, TRX, uh, TRX to their lending. Um, you know, they're now trading on PancakeSwap and their own Annex swap as well. Um, they released their farm. Um, you know, currently uh, they're live on uh, DeFilama. Uh, and then they recently also just added dot and ada to uh, lending as well so that's pretty pretty decent as well so overall guys and you know here here's the other thing as well there's there's like i mean if you want to stake the ann token there's uh there's pretty much three different ways that you can do that as well so you can either uh you can hold it you can hold it with automatic rewards and pretty much what that means is investors can hold the ann token in their wallets and earn up to 73 percent apr but uh, the rules are that uh, and the ann should not be withdrawn or transferred from your wallet um, but if so if if they are then uh, the timer will basically reset to zero but uh, after 30 days um, the user will receive six percent and thereafter they'll start receiving 0.2 percent every single day uh, you can also stake it by um, you know single staking on the farm or you can provide liquidity on pancake swap or uh, you know the annex dx dex as well so um, overall guys you know as far as their project is concerned and where they're going with it i mean they're they're doing a lot they're doing whatever they can to um, what i really do like about this project is that they're definitely they've got a very very good team of individuals who really care about the project that are really doing whatever they can to make it move forward and progress more and more and what I'm liking about it is that they're, they're, they're clearly doing whatever it takes to, you know, to grow and be, you know, the, the best of what they are in, you know, in the space. So, um, overall guys, you know, Hey, I think that's, uh, you know, that's pretty much all I wanted to say about this project. Um, but, uh, so that's going to pretty much do it for this video. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up you guys, but again, guys, Hey, before you leave, um, don't forget to follow me on Twitter with the link in the video description. And also guys, go ahead and take a minute to subscribe to the channel so that you never miss a new crypto and altcoin video from me. And with that said, you guys, Hey, thanks for watching. And I hope to see you guys all in my uh, future videos or chatting with me on uh, Twitter.